Hi there. In this video, I'm using ArcGIS Pro and it is um, 291. Uh, and it's actually a repeat of a previous video regarding coded domains, using domains. Uh, I have got a previous video where I used ArcMap, actually quite an old version, it was 10.5. Um, but that video stands, uh, is more or less exactly the same all the way through to ArcMap uh, 10.8 at least, um, if not 10.9. Um, but anyway, uh, uh, the, the point is I'm going to do the same thing here in ArcGIS Pro. So what, what, what am I talking about with coded, coded domains? Well, when you edit data, I want the user to be presented with a, with a sort of list to choose from rather than having to type it in. So let me just get on with it and you can see what I mean. So here I've got some OSM waterways, the OpenStreetMap waterways. And uh, when I click on this sort of blue segment here, it tells you a bit about it. It's Rothley Brook and, um, and there's a few fields. What I want to do is add another field about water quality. So I'm going to add a field, uh, data design fields. And I'm going to say new field at the top here. And I'm going to call it W quality. The data type is text field and I'm, I'm going to I want to I want to type stuff like you know good excellent poor or whatever acceptable um, so I'm just going to keep it fairly short length I've just made it 20. Uh, note when you're in here I can just click on this box and just drag the field up and down so I because I do want to bring it up a bit so now it's just underneath name so you can just drag stuff around uh, when you're done press save okay so let me just get rid of that um, so now when I click on this, you'll see I've got this um, null um, water quality field. And in fact, if I am in edit, let's just go to edit and look at the attributes and select this one again. Oh, select this one again. Um, you can see that um, in here I can type. Okay, I can type. But, but I don't want to type. I don't want my users to type. I want a drop down list. That's what I want there. So let's quit this. And um, the way you do that is to alter the data design again. So if we go to right hand mouse click again and go to data design, you'll see domains. Click on domains, the so domain name. I'm going to call it WQ for water quality. What's my description? Water quality and I've got a code description. Coded value domain, that's all it is. It's not a range, i.e. it's between values. Um, and there's a split and merge policy that we can apply when there's um, numbers or, or text. And I'll go with it, go about that in, a, in another video. But the point is, it's this domain name is called WQ. And over here on the right is where you type what you want. So I'm going to put um, P for poor. And these are the codes effectively, or you know, that, that are stored. And um, A is acceptable. So these are what are going to appear in my drop down list. G is good. And finally, E. Excellent. I could add numbers, but uh, you know, I'm just, just doing doing it like that for because it's a bit clearer, I think. Press save. So now we've made that domain, we need to tie it to a field. So I go to um, right hand mouse click and data design and go back to the fields option. And then you'll see water quality field line item. And one of the columns here is called domain. So all you do is click on that and select the name of, of your domain, what you called it. I called it WQ. So I choose WQ and select save. Okay. So now um, when I'm in edit, so I'm in edit, I'll just that's selected still, click on attributes. You can see that it says, um, W quality at the moment is null because there's nothing in there. But when I click, is a drop down list. I can say poor, 
say good, I can say excellent. And I accept null at the moment actually, but I could change that. But I'll set it to excellent and apply. And now when I click on that attribute, uh, click on that um, um, piece of waterway, it says water quality, excellent. So the, the very, very quickly then, the process is in your table, make sure you've got a field for your domain um, to be used against, you know, what you're selecting from. In my case, I made this field called water quality and you just set it to a domain that you've created. In this case, I call it WQ. And the domain is again, right hand mouse click, data design domains. And you can just create, um, there's the WQ, just create what you want there. Anyway, I hope you find that useful. Thank you.